Alright. Uh, my last video, which was how to put natural vegetation to your ghillie suit, um, I got some comments on it. And I got some good ideas from some people. Well, actually, only one person. It was a pretty good idea, though. Uh, or actually, request. But, um, so, he asked, um, he wanted to know how to put natural vegetation in your ghillie suit while you're laying down on the ground. And, uh, hold on, let me think of the other one. Uh, whatever, I'll check the comments later. But, um, okay, so this is an idea I made up. And, uh, okay, what you want to do is you want to get your burlap and just cut it into strips. This is a weird angle to cut in, though. <laughs> Alright. Just it doesn't matter what size, just about like this. And uh I'm gonna trim this up a little bit, it's a little too thick. Alright, there's the first one. Okay, and then what you want to do... Oh, I just remembered. Uh, the other thing was how to put leaves and, like, twigs and stuff in your ghillie suit while you're, like... You know, how to make them stay in, yeah. Okay, and I'll tell you how to do that later, but... Okay, let's focus on this first. Alright, what you want to do is... This is a thing I made up for the arms. Say you're laying down, you have this... You tie, you get the natural vegetation, grab it off the ground, and then first you put it on the top of your arm or wherever you want it. You get this, wrap it around, and tie it like this. You can use like anything you want to tie it with. This is just a demonstration of what I would use. And then you can adjust it and slide it onto your arm where you want it. And it should keep the natural vegetation in pretty good because I tested it. And so that's the first thing. And you can do that on the upper arm, lower arm, and I'll show you my other one. Let me turn off this camera. Alright, now so far, this is what I got with the leaves on the head. I'm demonstrating on the head, but it'll work the same on the, uh, the pants and the, what do you call it, the jacket but it takes a while. This took me about 15 minutes. I just looked around for a bunch of leaves that were in the area. I got some of these. Some of these dead ones and then these pretty yellow ones. And uh, what I did is you find a leaf that has a pretty long stem on the ground. It'll just be laying around. Let me find one real quick. <laughs> All right, let's see, this is pretty good. It has a long stem. And uh, what you just do is you get it, and you find the netting, which is about right there. I don't know if you can see, because all these leaves are in the way. But you just stick it in the netting, like you do with like any other twig you find, or that you just want to stick in. Just like that. And then for these, what I did, let me go get one real quick, Hold on. Alright, I found one that's just like this. And you insert it just like you did with the, uh, what do you call it? The, uh, leaves. Just like that. And then you get it and you just stick it in the netting. Get it in there good. There you go. 
that's in there. Yeah. And then, uh, for the leaves, another easier part, which is you just find anything, like branches or something. I only get one. See this pretty good one, and you get the stem, and you just get it and put it in there. See, and it stays in pretty good, and it provides like five or six leaves on the whole thing. And once you're done with that, it's pretty much all you need to do. Here, I'll go one of the show you something else. Alright, I found one that's just like this, and you insert it just like you did with the, uh, what do you call it, the, uh, leaves. Just like that. And then you get it, and you just stick it in the netting. Get it in there really good. There you go. It's in there. Yeah. And then, uh, for the leaves another easier part which is you just find anything like branches or something you only get one see this pretty good one and you get the stem and you just get it and put it in there See, and it stays in pretty good, and it provides like five or six leaves on the whole thing. And once you're done with that, that's pretty much all you need to do. Here, I'll go one of the show you something. Another thing I forgot to do is some of these branches from an evergreen tree. You just stick those in there, just like that, just the same as you did the other ones. And as you can see, I got this rope and you can just tie anything you want in there. Alright down here I got some moss and what I did is just, just like stuck it in there and like put some of the burlap around it and tied around with the other one like that like I got this piece crossed it over tied it with another one and it stays there pretty well because I just have moss all around my yard and yeah so all you need to do with the ghillie hat. It works on the whole suit though, also. And hopefully this helped you. And if it didn't, then you'll find your own way. That's what it looks like with it on. I'll go set it in the grass, see if we can find it. Alright. You could probably see him because you see it. Because, you know, it just like looks like a bush. It's like nothing else like that, but I'll go get it just in case it didn't. Here it is. Yeah, it works pretty well. And that's what it looks like. And mostly wherever you are, like wherever you live or anything you'll find just branches and branches have leaves and what you do with those leaves and you just find get the branches with the leaves on them and you just put it on there or the leaves on the ground like I said you just uh, stick them in there like a regular stick yeah so hope that helps